This is the Cloud Retailer Mobile Orders feature. As you can see here, you can either go into an existing order that has been set up either on a handheld or in the back office, or by hitting the plus sign, you can create your own. You do need to fill in an order type as well as give it a reference number. As well as a description is handy as well. And then it is ready for you to scan an item. And then it will give you options to add or change the value which you can do either on the plus and minus or by using the keypad on the bottom and either by hitting the add or the blue checkbox now backing up a step here order types um, whatever orders you set up will be in here one nice thing to do with this with this feature is to use hold orders as a line busting option. So what you would do is you would go if assuming you have a really busy day and customers are back several people, you would go to the customer, scan and create a hold order scan all their items and then save that save it and then it would go to the point of sale and then the cashier would just need to pull it up and for this case what you'd probably want to do is set the reference number to be Bob or Jeff you know whoever the person is in line so they can just reference that uh, before you use this, I do suggest you try it once or twice. Uh, the one thing that can be a little gotcha is the syncing between the handheld and the point of sale. So what you want to do is see how long it takes for the orders on the handheld to show up at the point of sale so you have a better idea of how many people back you should start scanning for and if the cashier say would need to hit the sync option to force a sync to get the order in so again i would suggest that you test that in your store when you have a chance just to make sure you've got the workflow down correct for that and that is the order feature with cloud retailer mobile thank you